So, Julie. Yes. How's it going? Great. I love it here. And, um, oh, oh then don't worry about it. She said we have no more of the bang long whatever juice it is. So yeah, that's no not a problem. Don't worry. No problem. That's fine. <laughs> Thank you. No no more bang. You're both on me. How do you say that? Bang long. The long long. A long long. That's fine. This is good. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so no more of the long long juice. So, um, Julie, uh, tell me a little bit about some of the things you've seen since you've been here. Um, right now we're in Chinatown and it's really cool. It feels like we're in China and then we're in Little India, which is cool. Uh, today we, we saw Jerry from Lenovo, awesome speaker. Um, very American compared to Douglas from a sushi place. And just hanging out with Jean. Yeah, Jean had some pretty good questions over the past couple days for some of our on some of our visits. Jean, you're a marketing guy, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. What it what you know, you asked a great question at Lenovo Corporation. What was that question you asked again? Uh, just about uh, first mover advantage and co-branding, how they plan to incorporate it in China. And what, did you get a sufficient answer to that question? Yeah, I think so. What did they say about that? Uh, Jerry seems like he's the type of guy that would just go for it and not really, I don't know, he doesn't seem like he would wait. He would just do the first advantage no matter what the cost was. Right. And you talked about national advertising, right? Instead of going in on a regional basis. Yeah. And he kind of confirmed that they they're going to go in on a national, right? Yeah. National. I think I think Nova has the brand power. Especially say about IBM, they have the brand power to sustain in China. Right. Now, when we were at Singapore Management University yesterday, Julie, what kind of um, computers were they the students using there? Um, I didn't see any Dell. There was a lot of Macs and um, Toshiba and what else? Um, HPs. HPs, yeah. Definitely everyone had Macs and iPhones though. So does that go against some of the things we've been hearing about Apple in Asia? Because even um, even Jerry today alluded to the fact that Apple has gone in with the iPhone but hasn't really done too much in the computer market in Asia. Yeah, I think he, I think the population that we saw was like the students, young students, maybe they're more into Max, whereas like generally the whole country has more um, other brands, but yeah, I definitely saw a lot of Apple influence in, uh, at SMU.